One of the most anticipated scenarios is the courtroom scene where Michael Corinthos and Carly will be present as Drew Kane takes a plea deal. Drew, in an attempt to protect Carly, agreed to spend six months in Spring Ridge, pay a hefty fine, and plead guilty. Zeke arranged the hearing and worked out an agreement's terms, and all seems to be going smoothly until Drew's deal falls apart. Drew faces a severe judge who demands that he spends two years in Pentonville. Michael worries about the consequences that Carly might face during this entire process. But Drew gives him his assurance that he will do everything in his power to keep Carly safe, regardless of the outcome. Meanwhile, fans will see more of the situation between Cody and Gladys Corbin, where Spinelli's help has been instrumental in shedding light on the allegations framed against Cody. However, Sam McCall eavesdrops on their conversation and records it, but her inclination towards what they're planning is cut short by Christina Corinthos Davis' sudden appearance. Selena Wu tries to defuse the tension between the parties involved, but the possibility of things getting out of control continues to linger. On the other hand, Sasha is convinced that Maxie Jones' suspicion about Cody's feelings for her is incorrect. Sasha insists that her relationship with Cody is strictly platonic. However, Maxie's doubts, Lucy's intuition, and Sasha's continuous denial suggest that there may be more to their relationship than what Sasha leads on. As Maxie and Lucy contemplate the situation, Sasha's sensitivity and defensive position only add to their suspicions. This makes for interesting viewing as general hospital fans are left wondering if they have missed some clues regarding the dynamic between Cody and Sasha. At GH, Gregory and Tracy are set to have another round of conflict. However, Tracy manages to steal a moment to speak with Alexis Davis about Ned Cordemain. Tracy's insinuation that Ned fell on purpose causes a flurry of reactions. Alexis manages to question this line of thought, prompting Tracy to alter her strategy. Tracy begins to emphasize Eddie, who is a significant part of Ned's past, and his failed attempts at a musical career. In doing so, she hopes to jolt Ned's memory and make him realize how different his perception of his past is from what truly happened. Alexis proposes speaking with Ned to gain more insight into his past and potentially help him confront the truth.